Hi everyone, my name is David Brimley. I'm the uh, VP of Product Management at Hazelcast. Hello everyone, uh, my name is Kevin Cox. I'm the VP of Marketing here at Hazelcast. Hazelcast has been around for about eight years and we're best known for our Hazelcast in-memory data grid solution. It is an operational and memory distributed computing platform that manages data using in-memory storage. As a grid, it operates in parallel, offering resilience and breakthrough performance. And this allows any application to operate at speed and scale, which is just so necessary when you look at the transition to the cloud and the direct access of consumers to applications and to data analytics in your system. We are here today to also introduce you to our new ultra fast third generation stream processing engine for low latency batch and stream processing. Hazelcast was one of the first to come out as an open source solution and doing so kind of reignited the market. We have about 160 paying customers today. We have a small number of excellent blue chip customers and a huge open source following. Here's an example of the type of applications that embed Hazelcast. We're used as the distributed infrastructure in many of these different technologies. It's very much an application developer's box for data, is the way I would describe it. Hazelcast IMDG is a schemaless store of information. Because the core of the operational data store is written in Java, it can be embedded into other applications and also into pieces of hardware. A lot of developers will build us into their system to add distributed capabilities and resilience. We yeah, so, so basically anywhere that Java can run, we can run. And so these are just some of the challenges that bring customers to us. The primary technical use cases for this technology, caching, is probably what we're most famous for. Data grids also offer a distributed computation model. We started to see in-memory data grids used quite heavily anywhere that needed real-time, very, very fast access to data. Now we move into a new era, especially with the Internet of Things, where data and real-time data has really exploded. This is where in-memory data grids and, and things like Hazelcast Jet have started to really come into their own. It's very efficient to store larger and larger data sets in memory. When you look at a traditional data store versus an in-memory data grid, you can start to understand some of the differences here. This is the ultimate difference between us and traditional databases. We can be connected to other underlying data stores, but the default system for us is we're purely in memory. And, and more importantly, they're distributed because of the shared nothing architecture that we have and the way that we cluster, we're very, very well suited to cloud environments. We provide professional support for open source straight up. But we also add unique enterprise features that include the management center that you saw. We also have a feature that allows you to upgrade the cluster without shutting it down. So this is very important for customers who have continuous operations. We have a very robust security suite, excellent industry-leading WAN replication. Jet is our second product. What we started to realize, we started to get more and more requests from customers around ingest. How do we deal and process with this huge explosion in data that's going on real time? Hazelcast Jet allows that high volume ingest, but at the same time, we allow a very sophisticated way of watching that data as it streams in and writing jobs that run against that data. Hazelcast Jet takes all of the tenants of the Hazelcast IMDG product, which are the horizontal scalability, embeddability, the low latency, distributed set of processes, and it builds on top of that this very, very sophisticated stream processing engine that can um, transform and it can run various aggregations um, and enrichments on data in real time. Jet is completely open source. You can go to github.com slash Hazelcast and grab the Jet code and, or you can download Jet and use it uh, completely for free. We've got a whole bunch of demo applications that are on GitHub. You can get to them via the website as well. It's the only reason people come to us. They have an unbelievably stringent service level requirement. Hazelcast and the IMDG is one of the most important technologies that you've never heard of, but you're mostly using in your everyday life. It enables unthinkable applications. 